Well, 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 ladies and gentlemen, I guess you didn't expect another boot race video again, right? Right. Well, today we're going to be doing another boot race. That's right. Another one. Now, we obviously did this before in previous videos with these two compact machines. You know, on the right is the AMD compact and on the left is the Intel compact. As I mentioned previously in previous videos. We started off with Windows 98. Then we did Windows 2000 Professional. Then we did Windows XP Professional. And in all those boot race tests, the AMD Compact won over the Intel Compact in terms of it booting up and shutting down, obviously. You know, mainly because it has, this thing has an EV6 based front side bus inherited from DEC Alpha, obviously. And as a bonus, I did a bonus POS Ready 2009 boot race involving the Intel Compact running POS Ready 2009 and the AMD Compact running Windows XP Professional, obviously, because I have not installed POS Ready 2009 on this system. And again, the AMD Compact won over the Intel Compact in that regard, you know, with the same aforementioned reasoning that I mentioned earlier, the EV6 front side box. So today we're going to be doing something completely different. We are going to be doing a boot race with Windows 2000 again, but this time we're going to be running it in two different versions on these two machines. The AMD Compact right here is going to be running Windows 2000 Professional, while the Intel Compact is going to be running Windows 2000 Server. So to give you a brief insight on the Professional and Server versions of Windows 2000, Windows 2000 Professional was the business slash high-end oriented operating system Windows based on NT, while Windows 2000 Server was the server oriented operating system Windows based on NT. So, I guess with all that being said, let's go ahead and power these machines on. So if you're ready, three, two, one, smoke test! All right. Let's see what we got. That's a very quiet floppy seek sound. And we got our memory check on this BIOS. 640 megabytes. Okay. And we're in the boot menu. So we're going to Windows 2000 server. And I'm waiting for that to uh, to do its usual boot routines, you know, checking memory and such. It checks memory a bit slower than the uh, Intel Compact. There's the floppy seek sound, and we're in. So let's go ahead and use Windows 2000 Professional, and I'm gonna put the camera down here, obviously, so. Let's do this. Simultaneous. Alright. Now that's gonna go. And that went. So here we are. That AMD Compact's running Windows 2000 Professional. And the Intel Compact's running Windows 2000 Server. Now, obviously... I've already mentioned it before, Windows 2000 Professional is the business oriented version of Windows based on NT, while this one is the server oriented version of NT, of Windows based on NT, Windows 2000 Server. Windows 2000 Professional was also meant for the high end PC market, you know, not just for business but for power users and etc. etc. That one taking its sweet time, obviously, you can take. And we're in the desktop. Alright, we're in. So I'm going to direct attention to 
BND compact here because I already knew like from all the previous boot testings that we've done this is going to get a slight advantage so, so in that case let me put these pack of CDs here so, here check to make sure there's nothing typed in the uh, password space otherwise they give us an error message and let's go three two one all right so that one went I think we have a clear winner it's this <laughs> the AMD compact wins again <laughs> well I think it's because this thing's running Windows 2000 server so it it takes time to load some server related stuff obviously so there's absolutely in no way it would outperform this one especially since this one has an Athlon processor with double pumped front side bus you know because I did the test with Windows 2000 Profession on both of them this one still beat it I also want to remind you that these are my test results this is in no way in comparison to all the other test results that people have done on you know YouTube or whatnot but these are my test results and take these with a grain of salt just a little brief disclaimer but I will show you on the properties Windows 2000 it doesn't actually show but this is running 2000 professional and this is running 2000 server obviously yeah it doesn't actually show but but it does show on the start menu Windows 2000 professional you see that right there and Windows 2000 server <laughs> right there so we're gonna be doing a shutdown sequence shut down we'll do shut down and then the camera down here and we'll do a simultaneous shutdown here Alright, I am ex I am certain that this is gonna win. This AMD compact with Windows 2000 Professional. Windows is shutting down. Windows is shutting down. Oh, and yet again, the camera was too quick for it to see it shutting down. The AMD compact. This one's taking its time. Well, I think we already have a clear winner in hand. The AMD Compact already wins. <laughs> yeah, 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 it, it, it's, it's pretty interesting. These are pretty interesting tests that I like to do on my end, obviously. It's just interesting to see how well they go to see my test results myself. It also goes to show you that this thing the AMD Power Compact. This one has an AMD Athlon processor at 800 megahertz. It's a Thunderbird uh, era Athlon, 800 megahertz, and this one is a Pentium 3, a Coppermine era Pentium 3 at 933 megahertz. Now the FSB in this one is 100 megahertz. And this one, the FSB is 133 megahertz. But because this one, the Athlon in this one has an EV6 bus inherited from Alpha, it actually has a double pumped front side bus or DDR, if that's what you want to call it. So this one actually has 200 
MT slash S. <laughs> That's how you want to say it. But yeah, that is that about these uh this boot race obviously. You know, it took me a little hiccups just to get this all working, but <laughs> we got there in the end. So yeah, that is the boot race. And I hope to see you again soon. See ya.